took my um, fifth generation Camaro to the Chevy dealership uh, about three days ago and they told me it needed some um, brake fluid and power steering fluid. I was thinking of doing it myself and I don't know I thought I just thought um, I could uh, show you guys a little tip on how to uh, change the brake fluid oil. Okay, so um, I just got here to AutoZone and um, I asked for the DOT3 uh, brake fluid. Uh, I got the brand uh, Pre-Stone. It's, uh, it's actually the, um, what you need. Like, there's other um, other brands, but I, I think this one this one's good for for any car you want to. I mean. It's not like if you're gonna take your car into the track or something. Uh, I got the 946 milliliters. So I woke up today and my car was super, super dirty. So uh, I decided to bring it to the car wash right now here at Indio. And let's see how it works. Um, it's the first time I tried this car wash. turn left and all of a sudden after I got out of the sh of the um, car wash uh, my car started uh, showing me that I need to check the left rear uh, turn signal light and now I have to check that thing as you guys can see there's something wrong with my uh, tail light I think I'm gonna have to take a look at it. All right, guys. Well, uh, here's my Pristone um, Dot Three brake fluid and my sucking tube. Uh, let's get this done. <laughs> Ok, 
Okay, um, we need to um, start up with uh, cleaning up the all the grease and um, dirt around the uh, fluid storage. Uh, just uh, in my opinion, you should uh, use some gloves because uh, you don't know what chemicals does that fluid have. But I decided to uh, do it like this. Um, so you're gonna need uh, something to suck out the fluid. I used uh, a uh, sucking tube, uh, the ones you use for uh, Thanksgiving. <laughs> To normally, to normally uh, put juice on top of the um, turkey, but uh, you can use uh, other things, whatever you you feel more comfortable with. Make sure you take as much possible fluid as you can, and just pour in the new fluid carefully, and you'll be good to go. As you can see, even the cap says uh, what fluid, um, what type of fluid you you will need for your car. Um, in my uh, case, uh, I need a dot three, uh, but there's I believe there's a dot four and dot five. Dot five is like for like uh, racing cars and all this stuff. All right, guys. So um, I'm pretty much finished. Uh, uh, changing replacing the fluid and I just uh, put it poured it back into this container and uh, to be recycled to AutoZone you can take it back to AutoZone and they will uh, recycle it and this is how my um, brake, brake fluid looks like um, it needed to be changed let me show you guys how nasty it looks. So this is my uh, my old fluid. It's pretty nasty. This is not how uh, it's supposed to look. That's my brake fluid. It's supposed to be like uh, transparent yellow, yellowish, and that's not transparent at all. And I hope you guys uh, like the video. Uh, just please subscribe and hit the like button for more videos. Thank you.